Hey there folks, this is Greeny XI, welcoming you right back to Let's Play uh, Thousand Year Door. This is... Oh, I don't wanna. <laughs> this is episode uh, 16. In last episode we started chapter 3, we checked out Glitzville a little bit. Oh, I got knocked into it. Yeah, we, we're checking out Glitzville. And we started the tournament, so we're now at rank 19. We need to keep on ri rising the ranks. Is that a word? Boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fix him for a fight, huh? Okay, then. Your next opponent will be... Ranked 18, the KP Coopers. Now, listen, son. In this battle, I want you to avoid swapping partners out. Okay. That's, that sounds fine. I'll take him Gumbella and hope for the best. Hey, looks like your next match is against me. Oh, that was quick. Good luck, man. To both of us. He is nice, but he's also bottom of the barrel. So we're just waiting for security to come now, right? I just healed up between the fights, so FP is, you know, is restored. Match time. Why only me? Why didn't it mention him? <laughs> We're both going. So if you lose, I guess you technically go down a rank just because somebody's going above you. But uh, it's not much of a loss, is it? Ooh, it's a flying one, so Gumbella was probably a good shout. For our next battle, we've got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Shell Machines of Doom. Yep, a fight to the finish with the KP Cooper Buzz. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. Meet my peeps, Gonzalez. I told you we were going to square off, and now it's on. Get yourselves ready to battle. Ready to rumble. Alright, so how are we going to do this? Ooh, she needs to do some tackling. Okay, we'll do the one that's just standing there first, I think. KP Cooper? KP, it's got the same sort of colour scheme as, you know, KP Nuts. <laughs> it reminds me of that. It's a Cooper Trooper of a slightly different colour. Max HP 4, attack 2, defence is 1. Looks like its abilities are just like any Cooper, so we ought to be a piece of cake. Don't go easy just because you know King K, Mario. That's what friends are for. So offensive four, I don't, I don't follow. Try normal jump. It should just do two damage, is it? Ah, oh, no, they go on the floor. Oh, yeah, I remember now. I remember now. How did I forget? Damn it! I was trying. I press B. There we go. Get a bit of damage in. And we'll tattle again for the guy at the back, the power trooper. Okay, we got them both. As a KP power trooper, it's a Cooper power trooper of a different color. 4, 2, and 1. Attacks are the same as the average Garden Variety Cooper Power Trooper. Just do the same thing as always. Stomp on it, flip it, drop its defense to zero. My hip mark is pretty effective against it too. Come on, let's get him. All easy now. All so easy. But like I said, we can we can get FP back. Huh. Yeah, I will do. I'll do a quick hammer. There we go. And she can get the guy down from above. Oh, she's gone. It's not going to happen. <laughs> we should finish a fight in this next turn. Both of them can just jump. There we go. Nope, I don't want hammer. Go away. I'd like a better hammer by now. His jump is just too much better than the hammer attack. You know. One star point. Ooh. <laughs> uh, fair enough. It wasn't a hard fight. We got ourselves a winner, the Great Gonzalez. What do you expect, huh? We rock! Yeah, we do. Mad skills with a Z. Here's your fight money of six coins. Oh, okay. You had five coins last time, that was six. A bit better. Right, we're at rank 18 now. If you excuse me, I must be going. Okay. We're having some easy con conditions so far. It reminds me a little bit of Final Fantasy Tactics Advanced when you had to win fights with certain conditions and things like that. Yeah. A little bit, but that was that was very strict. This is a lot easier to meet meet the conditions. Fix him for a fight? Ah, uh, we are. Who's next? Rank 17 in the Glitz Pits, the Pokey Triplets. Listen, son, in this battle I want you to use at least one special move. Okay. I'll do the earthy one, I think. Might be able to finish the fight in one too. No? Ooh, the bandit has gone. Oop, hello. Match time, follow me, Bob. Okay, let's go. 
Keep on climbing the ranks, one fight at a time. I can see why this would be considered tedious. I really can. But fortunately, it's got the characters, you know, the characterization of some of the fighters and the story to push it along. The spiked terror triplets. The pokey triplets. Yeah, let's get this over with. She's probably the wrong character to bring into the fight. I'll probably switch her out now for coops. Oh, this is an easy one. I was wondering if we'd see these guys here. Because like I said, we, we'll have a chapter later on where these guys are... Hmm, hold on. Where these guys are just standard enemies. But, uh, yeah. We're seeing them now ahead of time kind of thing. Which is fine by me. They're not exactly difficult enemies, so I'm just going to go a bit of FP. And we've boosted our FP, max FP, by... By five twice, I think. See if we can get it all. Ugh, one more. Ah! <laughs> no. It might be enough to finish the fight, though. Yeah. Easy. Easily enough. The thing is now, like they said, the minor league bed doesn't have, doesn't restore star points. So it's a. Uh, yeah. We need to build that back up again now, if we want to use it. Here's your fight menu, 7 coins. We're getting there. Rank 17. Yeah, we did. I know. Let's keep cracking on. I'm going to go for it straight away, I think. Oh. Did you just finish uh, beating down some poor fools or what? You're looking good, man. Yeah, we're doing good. The old King K wouldn't mind a little bit of your luck. Yeah, that'd be nice. Getting there, you. It's not luck based. <laughs> oh, he's back. What was he doing? How many times do I have to tell you? That room is absolutely off limits. If you want to remain on our fight roster, you must follow the rules. And don't think I ever noticed you following me. Stop that too. It's creepy. That is creepy. <laughs> if you don't obey the rules, we'll ban you from the glitz pit. Understood? Mm hmm. What's he up to? Again, dude, man, you're just a magnet for trouble. <laughs> Sorry, King K. Didn't mean to bring the rules queen in here. Ah, oh, don't sweat it, be money Jolene can take that too, and shove it up her nose. Why are you always chasing that girl anyway, man? Oh, you know, no particular reason. Now, oh, if you folks will pardon me, I must be off. Okay, that was a bit of something. Ranked match. On to the next. Oh boy, howdy. Yeah, yeah. Next opponent. The Dead Bones. Ooh. In this battle, I want you to let yourself get damaged at least three times, okay? Uh, yeah, I guess so. That's still easy. <laughs> yeah. I think the lead's got a little crush on me. Really? I'll take your word for it. Come on, then. Let's get going. You might be wondering, where's the... <laughs> is there anything other than these fights? And like, like I said, obviously story, there'll be a bit of plot as you go along. But, yeah, there is more to it. Luckily. We're going to take the skin off your bones. Okay, get yourselves ready to battle. There's three of them, we can get hurt three times. Does it mean Mario has to be hurt three times, or can anyone? There's my slight question. Let's see what the objective says. Take damage only three times. So I guess anyone. It doesn't specify Mario. So we might as well do a bit of appealing. Oop. While we wait to get hurt. We've only got one HP each and... Yeah. That was good. Ooh. What are we getting? More defense. I don't want more defense. This is the exact battle I don't want. That's insane. I don't want defense. Good, attack her. She hasn't got that extra defense. I know her extra defense has now vanished, so... That's annoying, isn't it? <laughs> Bloody hell. How long does that charm work for, anyway? It's, it's been a couple of chapters now, haven't it? There we go, that's three times. 
Damn it. <laughs> okay, let's finish the fight. Quick hammer. Didn't have to do this, but speed it up a bit. One star part, of course. I'm hoping by the end of the chapter we will be able to actually level up, but at this rate, who knows? See? No biggie. Exactly. No biggie. At all. Is your fight money and nine coins? Okay, it's going up, it's going up. Thanks, 16. I know. If you'll excuse me, I must be going. Any story? Oh, you again. I heard you just knocked some blocks off. Not bad, Double G Man. You're the real deal. The realest I've ever seen. Keep busting heads. And if anyone gives you lip, you just tell them King K said to back it up. Be it Zow. Huh? What's going on? My foot. <laughs> What's that about? <laughs> okay, anyway. It's a brutal sport sometimes, you know? This stuff happens. Hmm, I guess it does. Yeah, yeah, next one. Rank 15, Spike Storm. Be sure to use a partner skill at least once. Okay. We'll try and see if we can... We'll see if we can tattle. If there's a new enemy. How are you doing? You don't seem to like us, but... Moustache is okay. Oh, okay. He's... We're growing on him. We haven't even been talking to him, but we're growing on him. Okay, we are ready to go. Thumbs up. Hey. Aha, there are new enemies. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, the Midnight Spike Bombers. A fight to the finish with Spike Storm. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. We're gonna spike bomb you into submission, punks. I mean, with Gumbala out, I can see what you're thinking. <laughs> but, you know, use a party move at least once. Oh, we will. So, straight away, I need to tattle on the Lakitu. I want to kill him off first, because I get the impression he'll be able to make more of the little spiky shells. Max HP 5, attack 2, defense 0, attacks by throwing spiny eggs. If you stomp on it when it's holding up a spiny egg, you'll take damage, so don't do it. Spiny eggs slowly hatch into spinies, so beat the Lakitu before fighting the spinies. That's what I mean, I thought so. The book doesn't answer my real question, where does it keep all those spiny eggs? It's giving birth every time. Oh, I might as well use the spin jump then. Might as well have. Okay. Right, so we can't jump on him now. So we'll tattle. <laughs> That's a spiny. Basically a spike covered Cooper. Ugh, looks painful. Max HP 3, attack 3, defense 3. Wow, that's a lot of defense. These things have such high defense that you can't even hurt them when they roll up. So when they go back to normal, do all the damage you can and do it quickly. You flip them over, their defense drops to 0. That's the time it takes. To, that's the time to take it out. Stomp, uh, jumping on them is just plain stupid, so try using a power block or some other item. I might just wait till they, they turn back around. I will do a normal hammer attack. Nah. Yeah. I didn't think it would do anything. It might, it might have gone bouncing out, though. Right, good. So she can finish off the Lakitu. It didn't mention anything. Oh, yeah, it did. It did mention making more of them, didn't it? I think. Or was it just referencing the spike balls that it has above its head? It might just be that. Will this turn it off if I hit it with a hammer? No, so what? I guess we do just need to... Uh... Oh, Christ. I guess we do just need to use an item or something. Or what can we do? Ah, I double threat with a Balkan girl first breath. I don't know. I don't think we have any characters that can actually help. I'll try, Cooper. You never know. Power shell. Let's see if we 
can't jump on him. What do we do? Because if you don't have the item, which we don't, we can use the Earth Tremor. I reckon that'll work. But this is like a bit of a complicated fight. Come on, I don't want to miss this and have to store up more, more star power and drag things out. Come yeah, on, we got this. Is this random every time? I think it might be. Although that last line was the same, so I don't know. Particularly. Yeah, that did the job. So if I got the items, you still got a way of doing it. Only one EXP. That's shocking. Considering how you have to beat them. We got ourselves a winner. The Great Gonzalez. We did it, Mario. Wow. He's as shocked as everybody else. <laughs> Here's your fight. Many of 10 coins. Ah, oh, ta. Alright, we're on rank 15. We're getting there. If you excuse me. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> it looks like a comma or apostrophe or something for a doorknob. Hit the hot dog stand outside to get a new menu item that uses a mystic egg. Did you know the hot dogs can restore your HP and FP during a match? That's some serious nutrition. Not sponsored yet, just excited about some probably amazing hot dogs. You want to snack out on one? Is that a hint? I'm going to leave it. Let's keep going. I'm not sure if that's a hint to actually do it, kind of thing. The handed overs. In this battle, I want you to wrap it up in five turns or less. Oh, he's got he's got a date. Of course he has. Okay. How are you? Still? Are we still okay? Mustache is good. Oh. Yeah. Sure. We haven't had to fight these two yet. The bombs and the well. The craggy guy, but they. Ah, handed overs as in thieves. I get you now. The grim death burglars. A fight to the finish with the handed overs. Is one of them the one that was causing trouble? <laughs> awful quick, awful agile, and just plain awful. <laughs> I guess maybe? Just maybe? Winning five turns or fewer. I can do that. Simple. Oh, no. I want to... Hmm. Okay, swap partner. Let's get... Oh, Christ. <laughs> yeah, swap partner for Gumbella. Are they two different types of enemies or not? Yeah, bandit and big bandit. Let's go for the regular bandit first, then. See how much health it has, because I want to use Quake Hammer and get it done quick. Right, okay, so if we use Quake Hammer, they'll still be alive. The look on a bandit's face when you guard successfully is priceless. I want to see it. Okay, so if he doesn't flee, then we can uh, get our coins back that he can steal. Nice, that was a lot of damage. It'll help. Damn it. Your coin. Just one coin. I don't care if they take one coin. Wow, she is low on health. What happened there? Ugh, not enough. We can't tattle now. Oh no. We'll see him again, I'm sure. <laughs> Oh, wow, they're still alive. How? Oh, they're going. <laughs> That's fine. I'd like to be able to kill one of them at least, though. There we go. Got your coin back. Good. Winning five turns or fewer? That worked. Every five do as well, so I guess after every fight, your partner revives. We got ourselves a winner. I just forget that I couldn't tackle the, the green guys, but the big ones. The big ones, air quote. 
Here's your fight money, 10 coins. We'll have to heal up this time, for sure. Yep, bye bye. We're nearly up to the, the Major League sort of levels. Did you hear the latest, G-Man? My boy said they saw a stunning babe having a juice at the first juice shop. She likes juice, I like juice, we already have so much in common. Check her out for me, man. Okay, I think we will break it up a little bit with something other than a fight. Obviously, we're going to rest. But even after that. <laughs> right, yeah, let's go outside for a sec. Oh, quicker to go this way, innit? Yeah. That's good. They, they designed that a little bit well. So you can leave whenever you want really quickly. Ooh, what's going on by you? <laughs> ah, him. Yeah, try to be me. Yeah, everyone loves him. Hi. I mean, literally they do. He's a bit of an arrogant little shit, but... No, stop that at once. This behavior is unacceptable in food stuff. I insist you desist. Oh, there's the egg he was talking about after the last fight. Before this one. <laughs> Imported egg. Go on, lad. Let's go grab him. Get. He. Crack him open. Ah, he's up there. It makes sense now. That's why we have to be able to get there in the paper plane. Yeah, fly. That's exactly how you have to do it. <laughs> He's asleep. I love it. Let me check something. I just noticed something. Can you... No, you can't go back there. It looked like a narrow bit. Ah, it's got the rope there. I see. I see. So yeah, at any point, you can actually leave. It's not like... It is a little bit tedious, but you can actually leave and do other things if you want to. Look at the balloons, I love them. I love balloons in games for some some weird reason. In cell shaded games and stuff. Huh? Did you hear that, Mario? You don't want to be eating little eggy weggy? It's so adorable. What should we do, Mario? Should we help? Yeah, that they be hot dogs. <laughs> if you're gonna say that, Mario, then I guess we should help. Mr. Hot Dog Stand Guy, it looks like this egg doesn't want to be eaten. It's okay to let it go, right? It's imported. Fine. So it's just not much market for cuisine that jumps anyway. Awesome. Did you hear that little eggy weggy? You're free. See you around. Huh? What's it now, eggy? You want to follow us? Is that it? I'm pretty sure our little buddy here wants to hang out with us. Uh, of course. Hear that little guy? Just make sure not to get in our way though, okay? Oh, we got our own egg. Let's go. Also, after this fight, we were told about the, the fresh juice place. So let's see what's happening in here. Is it you? Sean Trulon Brightly. Okay, it doesn't seem to be anything going on. Ooh! <laughs> okay then. They said they got a new flavour or something. Yeah, he wants to be the strongest guy alive. It, it makes sense considering where he works and stuff. Uh, I don't know. Let's go. Let's go back in and carry on with the fight then. It's interesting to get out there for a bit and break it up a little bit, I think. Which way do we come out? Over the left? Yeah, yeah, it is. Everyone's left now. Rook has left. See, all he has to do is keep his keep his title. Ooh, Hello. Hey there, Gonzalez. How's it going? Me? I'm doing a little research. Speaking of which, ever heard of the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit? This place has rumours and secrets and spades, but Kingdom Hearts 2 uh, does this as well. These things fascinate me, so I wander around doing research on them. Hmm, so how about it? Want to hear about the Seven Wonders? I guess we could. The Sealed Wall? They say there's a sealed wall in the Mind League locker room. Some say the remains of fallen athletes are stored in there. Is that the one with the big block there? We can't do anything about that. 
man eating toilet? They say in one of the arena's bathrooms, a man eating toilet lurks. Some say that anyone who sees this toilet never sees anything again. We could check on that if we're allowed in. They say there's a room in the glitch pit with a second floor but no stairs. They say no one's ever gone upstairs. And some say the groaning voices sometimes come from that second floor. Oh, okay. The haunted b boudoir. They say that the champion's room is haunted. Oh, Christ, my alarm went off. Scare me shitless. <laughs> if you keep... Some say if you keep still in the room, you'll hear voices whispering from nowhere. Some even say the voices of athletes who lost to the champion. Okay. Spooky ring lights. My friend's friend's friend told me this one. He said he saw a strange light leaking under the ring doors when no one was there. He couldn't see inside since the doors were locked. I plan to investigate this myself. There's nothing much we can do about most of these. The missing ones? They say sometimes fighters disappear for no reason, never to return. Some say that the very first champion, Prince Mush, was spirited away in this way. Oh, I love that film, Spirited Away. I like a lot of Japanese sort of stuff. It's why I like my JRPGs. I'll never go to Japan, I doubt. It's a sad life. <laughs> but, um, I'd like to. The rural parts more than anything. Like, if you've seen Higurashi. Oh my god, I'd love to go to a rural part of the Japan like that, where there's nothing there for miles. and you know. Anyway, Grub is a strange one. His body's incredibly toned, even though he's past 60. Really? He must have an exceptional training regimen. Then there's the matter of Miss Jolene. They say she suddenly vanishes at times. Some say a fighter saw her go into the bathroom and waited for her to come out. But she never did. Think it's stranger that someone staked out their bathroom? You're a point. I remember one time when I was in uni. We all just sat outside the toilet. <laughs> our house toilet. And uh, waited for him to come out. And we all just laughed at him. Memories. <laughs> I smell a rat behind all this and someday I'll solve all these mysteries. If I want to hear more about this stuff, just let me know. Okay. Let's see if we can go in other rooms then. Like obviously we can't go in the Major League one. That makes sense. We can't go and see Bubba. Grubba, Bubba, Grubba. That one's locked. How about this room? Champion's room. Oh, okay, fair enough. We can't go in there. Major League locker room. Can't go in there. Makes sense for all of these. How about this one? Minor League locker room. We are minor league. What the hell? Okay, we gotta just keep fighting then, I guess. Let's do another one. And keep cracking on. We're getting through it quite quick, to be fair. We've gone up like six or seven today, and we've checked out some other stuff going on around the place. So that's not bad going, right? It is, you know, it is what the chapter is. This. So it makes sense that it takes a while. There goes the egg. Yeah, you stay there. Ranked match. Let's keep cracking on. <laughs> Ranked 13, he is the Mind Bogglers. Listen, son, in this battle, I want you to avoid using any of them. They're special moves. Okay, that's easy. We can just use some. We can still use FP and stuff, can't we? So. Oi, I was trying to check on my egg. <laughs> He's happy. So what happens if you never go out and check on the egg? I'm, I'm guessing at some point you have to. Ooh. For our next battle, we've got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Grey Entanglers. A fight to the mind with the Mind Bogglers. We aren't going to lose to the likes of you. Prepare to be ensnared, mystified, and devoured. They look sort of hipsterish. <laughs> oh no, those sorts of goths where they're like, I'm all about the style, but I don't actually care about any music going. Okay. It's only two of oh, a spider on the back. I didn't notice that then. Right, let's kick things off by getting rid of... Yeah, the cloud. Before he goes all electric-y. I should have tattled it. Bollocks, I didn't realise. Was it a new enemy or not? Say now. It might not have been. Wow, it was a long way to jump and I pressed A too soon. There we go. Our hammer attack should now finish him off. Damn it! I got it right the once. <laughs> so yeah, this this hammer. Actually it might not finish him off. Unless we super guard again, that might work.
Look at all the enemies in the crowd. Oh no! Ooh, close. We nearly had the three poison mushrooms. That would have been bad. Bollocks. I missed it. Never mind. We should be done now. Here we go. See, the fights haven't got tough yet. Two. Two star points. Definitely catching up to the enemy levels a little bit. Nothing worth mentioning, but a little bit. What do you expect, huh? We rock. We do. She's right. Here's your fight many 12 coins. Thank you. I will treasure them. Your rank rose uh, because you met the conditions. Yeah, okay. If you'll excuse me, I must be going. As always. Ooh, somebody else is playing Thousand Year Door. Hi. That's somebody I met when playing Mario Wonder, I think. And we helped each other get through like the hardest level in the game. It was so much fun. It's such a good game, Mario Mario Wonder, Super Mario Wonder. If you haven't played it, because you're thinking, it's just another 2D Mario. No, it's got the drug-induced nature of like Mario Galaxy or something mixed in with a 2D Mario. It's incredible. It's actually incredible. I didn't read what you were saying then. What did he say? Ooh, I just... Okay. Tattle log. No. No, there's no way to look back. That's a bugger. That's... Yeah. Oh, was he saying you'll be going up a rank soon or something? Let's do one more. Come on now. Yep. Yeah. Okay, your next opponent will be... Rank 12, the Punk Rocks. Ooh, this could be tough. I want you to avoid using any of them. They're flower points. Oh, no! That's how I would do it. I guess we'll have to use the earth power thing. No flower points. That's, that's annoying. Mustache got game. He's loving us. Okay, give me two sacks. I want to talk to bob -omb. How do I nod into it? Yeah, I, agree. I can see that. How's our health looking? Perfectly fine. Let's go. Okay. For our next battle, we've got the Merciless Execution of the Grey Gonzalez and the Green Torture Squad. A fight to the finish with the Punk Rocks. Yeah, it's going to be them. <gasps> Is he the one from in our, in our room as well? They don't seem to be mentioning it, so maybe not. Who knows? I can't use FP. And I haven't got enough star power. So, yeah, I'm going to appeal with Mario. And tattle here. It doesn't use FP to tattle, so why not? Uh, hyper bold cleft. <laughs> is that bold? Like cleft, some bold clefts. This is also a rock monster. Max HP 3, attack 2, defense 2. So we have to do quite well, I think. Ooh! Hyperversion can build up its energy, boosting its attack to 8 on the next turn. Wow! That's a lot of attack. Item attacks are pretty effective. I mean, we could do, but like I said, I can use the Earth Power for it, I think. Here we go. Wow, that is a lot of attack power, though. And if we get hit by all three of them, it could kill off a character, couldn't it? 8, 16, 24. Uh, well, it will with Mario, because he's lost a bit of health before. I didn't expect that. Right, anyway, Earth Tremor, we gotta do well here. They got good defense as well, so I think we gotta get it pretty spot on. Okay. That's a third. Fourth, last one. Oh no, too soon. It might still be enough. Come on. Yes! <laughs> a fair bit more than enough, actually. Yeah, the conditions are again a little bit more limiting, right? Hard enemies that you can't use FP for, that's, that's pretty limiting. We rock. No, they rock. They made a rock. Yes, you fight many 12 coins. Thank you. Ooh, rank 12. Not bad. 
If you excuse me, I must be going. Bye bye. Any hints about anything else going on? No? So we just carry on. Okay, ooh. Where's Goldie gone? Odd. That is odd. Where's he gone? Yeah, okay. But. Cleft can't think of criticism for Moustache. Oh, he wants to. <laughs> okay, so I guess we're going to end things off there. We've, Like I said, we've done quite a bit, so why not? This has been Greeny XI. Hope you've enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. 